Well, Baker Mayfield's contract is three year, hundred million dollars, but essentially, um, you can think of it as a two year deal, sixty million dollar contract, and they're making him show his worth by two thousand twenty six by giving him a base salary of twenty six million in one year. So yeah, it's a good deal, great deal, but it's not compared to the Lamar Jacksons all this stuff. So even though they paid him good, I think it's more so that the money's good in the NFL right now. Is it a guy we want on our team? Yes. Can we deal with him for a couple more years? Remember the five year plan? That'll put him at five years to reevaluate. Do we need to go get a franchise quarterback and all this stuff? But it wasn't the elite deal. You know what I'm saying? So, right. but everybody's satisfied though. It's Tampa Bay. It's Tampa Bay. So, what you got, man? What you what you thinking of so, the whole scenario? So, so before, before I touch, before I touch on it, are they are they uh, a Super Bowl caliber team? This no, I'm gonna say 24 no. season. No, I'm going to say no. I, I don't think they're Super Bowl caliber. I think they did some good stuff. They made it to the playoff last year, but I still don't think they're Super and Bowl And they won a the playoff game. game. They won a the playoff game. You know, right. they gave, I think they fell short to the Detroit Lions. Um, right. But, uh, yeah, so my but take. But it's, it's, it's Baker uh -huh. Mayfield, too, now. Here's the last thing I'm going to say. It's Baker yeah. Mayfield. He's streaky. You know, you know he's a gamer. Nobody doubts that Baker ever since his days at Oklahoma. He's going to be a gamer, but right. do you think he's got it to where he's going to sustain it for the amount of years, which is probably the question that the GM asked. Do we see him as a franchise quarterback, or he may have one great year, then next year he's going to fall off? They don't know. But go yeah. ahead. Yeah, I think the, the perception is playing on our emotions when it comes to Baker Mayfield. I think, like you say, he is who he is. He is he's a streaky type of player. He definitely has energy and a, a player you want to play with. I don't know about his ego and, you know, the arrogance or whatever he might – he bring to the table and stuff like that. But far as I see and things like that, he's a he's the player that uh you know you want on your team to you bring that type of energy. But mm -hmm. the the perception is that he's revived his career. He's doing great. He's uh he led this team to the playoffs. But the division is ah, and that's what I mean. So it's it, it, yeah, you, you got to give the credit when credits due. You 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 led this team to the playoffs. They made it to the playoffs. You won a playoff game. You beat the Eagles and things like that. But in reality, can you do it again when these teams in, a, in what is it, the NFC East get better and continue to get better and better? Uh, mm -hmm. I don't know, man. I, Baker Mayfield, to me, he's not the championship caliber quarterback, but mm -hmm. in the right situation with the right talent, timing, you know, the, the, the division, Things like that, you know, stuff can pop off as we seen last year. But for me, for, for him to repeat and do what he did last year, um, I think that would be a big, a big stretch. You know, Mike Evans, like I say, they 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 brought the key players back in the talent. But yeah. I don't know, man. I always think about how he handled uh, Odell Beckham when he was the uh, and when he was in Cleveland, when Cleveland right. and and Odell Beckham and Baker Mayfield was together. So. Um, you live and grow, so you got. Uh, that's why I love to give people chance and opportunity to see what they can do in the future. Because you know, you're learning from your mistakes, you grow and you mature and stuff like that. And like I say, man, things come at you so fast coming in the NFL, being young and, and all that attention and stardom is coming at you. It, it, you know, it, it comes to your core character, how you were raised and built. And you know, sometimes some people don't know how to handle it right off the rip, and it takes a while. Mm -hmm. But you know, I, I don't know. We can see, like I say, this division with you got the, the Carolina Panthers. They definitely not going to be doing anything. You got the New right. Orleans Saints. Uh, possibility. You know, they're going to yeah. be challengeable. But the Atlanta right. Falcons is definitely someone you got to be be worried about, and they right. will be challenging them. The, you know the, what I mean? Depends their on who their away. quarterback. Their quarterback it, away. <laughs> depends on who their quarterback is going to be. Yeah. Exactly. Their quarterback <laughs> away. Their quarterback away. And they was in the. Uh, Talks for getting Justin uh, Fields, obviously. Mm -hmm. And like I said, they're going to use him as a, a backup or, you know, a hybrid type situation. But they're, go they're in, the, in the draft. They wanna, they're going to get somebody. They're going to get right. somebody somehow, some way. They want a quarterback. Like uh, uh, Raheem Morris said, he stated, he says, I probably wouldn't be here as the new coach if the quarterback play was good. Right. So. He letting be known, man. He letting it be known, man. So, but but Tampa Bay today, uh, if I had to give the they they coming out on top of that division, um, I got to give them the best team in that division as as of right now. Yeah, um, as of right yeah, now. they're the most solid solidified team in that division. When you just broke it down, 
it made me realize how bad that division was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's so, pretty bad. It's pretty bad. It's pretty, so imagine yeah, they yeah, making moves. <laughs> they yeah. just get out of the division. Like, no matter what, let's go ahead and sign Baker. Let's go ahead and sign Mike. We're going to be the right. best team in this division, and we can go from there, you know?